All right. Hello. Good morning. How's everybody doing? Welcome on into the House of Strays. I'm Arctic Chillin, resident safety otter and host of your House of Strays. Um, hi, Savage. Hi, Carrot. Hi, Cola. Hi, everybody. All the Q beans this morning. Or afternoon. Or evening. Who knows? At this time. Let's go with that. <laughs> Anyway, it's Friday, end of the uh, the normal week work or er, week work, the normal week work. Yes, yes. But yeah, we made it to another weekend. Uh, so it's also a new month. Welcome to September. September. Uh, I'll be doing something uh, later on in the month. Um, Soon, there's a lot more to figure out than I originally thought, to be completely honest. Uh, so, um, yeah, we'll be doing something sometime this month. Uh, I'll definitely make sure I post enough notice for, for, for people. And, um, yeah, sorry, my coffee's still kicking in. So yeah, let's uh let's get over to the game. We're gonna be playing some Dave the Diver. Um We're getting down to the glacier well actually we just opened the glacial pass. So uh it'll be interesting to to see how this story goes. do a long one make sure you prep foods and drinks before and to make sure you make sure you do it healthy i mean as keeps getting pointed out to me i do long streams anyway anywhere from six to 16 hours six days a week so is, is there a difference i, I don't know We'll figure something out. We'll make it different. We'll do something. It'll be it'll be interesting. I had thought about uh Doing a whole bunch more VR stuff. I got I got several VR games, um, so it might be interesting to uh, stress test the uh, Steam controller batteries. See how we handle that. Uh, not healthy, huh? I would say the reverse subathon would work where we donate to make you stop streaming. Hard limiting you to only three hours a day. I mean, wouldn't be the first time I got paid to shut up, so. Ah! I'm kidding. I'm just playing. Uh, that's definitely an idea, though. Um, so, I'll look into that. And, uh, like I said, we'll figure out something. We'll do something to make it fun. Hi, Delta. <laughs> Hi, Akronos. Banger of a song, too. So, Arkanos, um, don't mind me hiding while I you're hiding while you scream. I hope that meant stream, but I hope everything's okay. Um, 
So the other day, I say the other day, it was probably uh, uh, a couple weeks ago, you were doing Baldur's Gate and you were calling out Fireball as you call it, as you cast Fireball. I want that as a blurb. Exactly the way you were doing it. I want that as a blurb. I think it'd be hilarious. <laughs> On it. <laughs> nice. No, you meant scream. Oh, no. Yeah, I hope I hope everything's all right, Delta. If you need anything, let me know. All right. It's morning. We got hunt spider crabs and fang too. So those are in the deep water. Hi, Shell. How's it going? Chat. Somebody left the window open, and a wild shell rock has appeared. I'm just gonna put my head in a in a public mission blender of uh, GW2. Try to find a group of people going for Griffin stuff. Oh, okay. It's going. Well, it is Friday. I'd offer to help Delta, but I'm I'm uh nowhere near high enough level to to really make any difference to you i don't think you spent your gold 250 already did you have an in-day money visitation day or an in-game money visitation day Very few, very few can, it's fine. Okay. Well, I guess if you need cannon fodder, let me know. I might be able to do something. Maybe, probably not. Kicking off your four day weekend. That's awesome. Yep, Monday is a holiday. Still working. You at least getting holiday pay for it. you are the union gets a ring that's good i think i did that already but that's fine
working on a holiday sucks, but holiday pay does not. Oh, I can't feed her anymore? Can I feed them? Oh, yeah, I can. Oh, I already did. Okay, never mind. This is what happens when I try and set myself up to be ready for the next in-game day and then quit the game. I don't remember what I did. Gives you a reason not to see family. I feel that. I do. What's our event? Oh, cucumbers. That's right. Some people want to make food gross. Stargazer, wheat, olive oil, and eggs. Okay, that was easy. Park to Boncho. Oh, okay. So I do need to go to the sushi restaurant. I don't like cucumbers, but a chef should be able to deal with any food ingredients given. I know a few recipes. There'll be an event hosted by the cucumbers. Cucumberers. I don't like that word. That's hard to say. I'll just say a good bit of family doesn't agree with my life choices and likes to spout their opinions, so not being around them is very okay with me. Oh, that sucks. That really sucks. So I kind of have a little bit of a weirder view for family. Like I was very lucky. I have a very supportive family. Um, and uh, yeah, I didn't, I didn't get too much flack from anybody. I got a little bit, but not too much. Um, But, so, but yeah, I'm sorry to hear that. Um, but yeah, my, uh, my view on family is, uh, family is a title that's earned. Just because you're a relative of mine doesn't make you family. Uh, and I have, I have people that I hang out with a, for, you know, on a regular basis or people that mean the world to me who are not related to me, who are most definitely family. So, I think people think that just because you share genetics, they get a free pass to be assholes, and that's, that's not okay. Family is what you make, not necessarily by blood. Exactly. Yep. Blood makes you a relative, not family.
I'll prepare several cucumber dishes and the dishes, add the dishes to the menu when you have the ingredients ready. Pickled vegetables, deep fried vegetables and skewered cucumber. I agree, you get to pick who. Oh, for the love of crap. Hold on. I'll fix that volume here real quick. So all of my USB devices just reset. Um, this has not happened all week, like in six days or six, seven days that it hasn't reset on me like that. And I have less plugged in than I did the last time. I'm confused. Oh, well, so if the audio goes quiet, let me know. Um, then I'll remember to turn the mic back up because it resets to 48% every time the uh, mic initializes. Because thank you, Windows. Yeah, it's, it's really odd. I can't figure out why it keeps doing it. is complicated yes 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 they are for getting vr i had to get another powered usb hub i can only imagine the amount of stuff you have plugged in uh, i have a powered usb hub um so it's just it's just kind of weird But yeah, between VR and, um, I don't know, all the different, like, mic, camera, mouse, keyboard. Uh, well, the game controller port is off, because I got a hub that you can turn the ports off when you're not using them. Um, art pad. Everything. So much stuff. Full body trackers. Um, yeah, let's start down there. Actually, no, we'll go, we'll talk to the shop. I haven't plugged in my VR set. Uh, 
Reminds me, I haven't plugged in my VR stuff since I used it late. But totally not gonna forget again before getting home. Ooh, gun enhancement kit. Yes, and... Yes. Yeah, I think it was last week I had forgot to plug in my controllers, went into VR with 40%. Didn't, didn't last too terribly long. Only a couple hours. Just in case he decides to drop it. Oh, nope, we're good. Wait, what was that? Shock rifle. Okay, good. I get six to eight hours depending on what I'm playing. Yeah, that's about where uh, where I'm at on it. Um, hundred percent. Usually get about seven and a half hours pretty consistently. Fortunately, they don't take too long to uh, recharge. Roof shark just all the way over to the left because we can. Maybe only one shot. Nope. Seahorses are half a kilogram each. Those are massive. Oh, missed. katana necessary for a uh, good deep sea diving kit you gotta have your katana oh 
Oh. I almost swam right by those twice. Needs a dive dice or a dive knife when you have a katana. Absolutely. It's just a bigger, uh, bigger dive knife, right? Saw something different. There's all the sharks in here. Doesn't go anywhere. This is a waste, but I'm not going to come all the way back through here just to grab that. Level two, sure thing. I mean, it's not a complete diving kit without a. There you are. I knew you were gonna be around here. Without a freaking sniper rifle and a katana. need to find more of those sea grapes they're supposed to be at medium depth but i can't seem to find them anymore Just realize auto correct and like the word dive i don't know why it auto corrects correctly spelled words because auto correct is a bitch it knows what it's doing Oh, 
Nej, nej. Cuttlefish, a barracuda, cuttlefish I think I need. Eleven shows in movies where people shoot shoot after people that jump into the water or like that. After like a good, what? Eleven shows and movies when people shoot after people that jump into the water. After they're like a good down, those bullets are doing nothing and it's just a big waste. Yeah. I mean, water does show, slow the bullets down. Um, slow the bullets down a lot. Uh, but it's still, it's still not that, uh, still not that, uh, ineffective. Also, it's dangerous to shoot around water because, uh, it can actually ricochet. Hi, Death. I'm doing good. How about you? How are you doing? Happy Friday. Boxing gloves underwater. Deal substantial damage, really. I'll try them. Why not? Good Friday, quiet one too. That's awesome. Oh, I hit that button. Hydrate, okay. I knew there was error here. Oh, that, yeah, that's right. That one bottoms out. Okay. Anyone got any um, plans for the weekend? Fun plans, boring plans? screaming now that's that's good do I play D&D um I mean, I used to. I I like D and D. I just haven't haven't played it in a long time. Just got seven achievements needed to do 
before I obtain it. Oh, wow. I didn't realize you had to have certain achievements to uh, to get it. That makes sense, though. So. Play some games, just hang out. If I can get away with it. Cool. Sounds like a good weekend. Oh, thank you. Unlock the achievements via side quests. Ah, that makes sense. So if you want some of those uh, better mounts and stuff like that, the game makes you be an achievement hunter a little bit. Legit had to wiki the whole thing. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'll be in uh, VRC this weekend. Um, got a, an event to go to tomorrow night. Um, and tonight's uh, the usual drink night, so it's a good time to hang out with peeps. when you get a achievement they give you points that up uh, uh, you get rewards at certain a certain interval intervals that's cool oh that's a frilled shark down there okay I don't remember how tough you actually are Like gold and skins and other things. Oh, cool. Back in the, the days that I uh, played primarily on Xbox Live, I was a complete, uh, I was a total achievement whore. That, that gamer score was everything. Ooh, level three. Yes, please. And I haven't really lost the achievement hunter tendencies. Uh, if you don't believe me, go ask Mikey. Last time we played Journey to a Savage Planet, it was like a 14 hour stream because we were scanning every blade of grass.
three skulls in one run. That's ridiculous. Oh, they really want me to go after these uh, minerals. Ooh, shovel. Huh. Grenade launcher. I never thought I'd say this, but the grenade launcher is just too weak. chicken hello that sounded big because it was oh no I only have one rifle round I might be in trouble I might very well be in trouble Nice. Oh wow, that slows me down considerably. giant crab. Wow, that's a lot of cat food. I am not going to eat cat food for a while. the entrance to the underwater lake being this uh, treacherous. Oop, thank you. Excellent. Need one of those. That three of five. Okay. Oh, wow. I'm completely full. Uh, which ones don't I need? Trucks have shown up, so I gotta do work. Be back after. Good luck with the dives. Thanks, Savage. Good luck with the trucks. Don't hurt your back. Real Shark, Nautilus. Blue Shell, Orange Star, I don't need those. Of course, those are super light. Glass I don't need.
Pink shell I do need. Rank one. I need not too many of those. Home jellies, huh? Look out the goblin shark and the comb jellies moved in. Probably good because it's probably lethal. Stargazer, frilled shark. Oh, wow. Just a home of all kinds of sharks, isn't it? Okay. Well, I can't carry them, so I don't see the need to kill them. Even in video games, I don't like hunting if you can't uh, can't use it. Don't get me wrong, I'm not against hunting. Uh, but if you're going to do that, there should be a, I mean, a good outcome from it. It, it should be used and not just like trophy or nothing. How's it going? How was your Friday? Actually pretty good. That's good. I'm really glad to hear that. Got any plans for the weekend? Oh, another shark. Sea toad. Oh, there it is. Going climbing. Oh, nice. And some lobster. Nice. That sounds amazing. I haven't been climbing in years. I used to be belay certified um, for uh, just basic rock climbing, but I, I haven't done it in so long.
Do you ever do uh, bouldering or anything like that? What you started off doing? Okay. Bouldering is a lot of a lot of fun, and I actually kind of think it's harder than on a wall. But I've only done in indoor climbing. I haven't, and a little bit like a. Uh, Sectioned off outdoor, I haven't done a whole trek or anything. I think it'd be fun to do, but I'd have to get in a lot better shape first. Oh, you broke your shoulder in a uh, bike accident? Oh no. Oh, I hope I hope uh, that healed up. Uh, quickly and like it's supposed to. Oof. Oh, yeah. I've got a little debris in my shoulder joint as well. Last winter, I uh, was salting during a freezing rainstorm, and, uh, well, I ate the ground super hard. So I tried to connect my elbow with my uh, shoulder via blunt force trauma. Fortunately, I didn't break anything. So, you know, I got lucky there, but, yeah. Well, hopefully that doesn't uh, stop you climbing. I miss climbing. Damn you physics, right? Curse you, gravity! Crops are all grown. Oh, I guess some of them are all grown. Oh yeah, the onions. Okay. Those are not... the whole plot okay cool
Ice Patty level 2, Field level 2, Watering Can 2. Okay. I guess because I kind of figure I'm running out of dive gear to upgrade. Breaking in cash yet? Uh, well, I haven't gone negative since that one and only time, so I guess sorta. We have a new event coming up in a couple of days. Super exciting. Cucumbers. Ah, why? <laughs> Yep, it's a cucumber event in a uh, in a diving game. All right. Well, I have all the ingredients that I think I'm going to need. So we're going to go try to progress the story a little bit. You're doing a subathon? Yes. I'm not going to do it today at the start of the month. Um, I got a couple of things I need to figure out. Uh, also, I'm just kind of trying to stagger it a little bit. Uh, Twitch is not doing any of their September promotions till the very end of the month. I don't think I'm going to wait that long. Um, but it, uh, you know, I'll give it a little bit. Cola recommended I do a reverse subathon where people pay me to not stream. I think I think that's an interesting idea. Are you sub to cut down the time? But I think if that if that would work, it'd have to be a like a true endurance. Like it's like I'm going 48 hours straight. I'm not stopping. And if you want. If you want me to stop, you have to sub. I think that's that would be the better way, but I don't know. Maybe I should do that super crazy one where people are locking themselves in a dark closet for three days. The whole challenge. And uh, chat can pay bits and stuff to like flash bright lights and play alarms and different blurps and stuff for the record that's a joke i'm not that insane or that desperate <laughs> could do it where you have to complete a game in a stream people can also reduce sub to reduce your time if you fail you get punished i hadn't thought about that yeah like come up with a theme or a series of games uh, and be like we are we are doing these and these will be done um, and uh, you know you either sub to add to it or subtract from it I guess Wanted to tell you I'm back in the restaurant business, but couldn't find your number. You're a mermaid. You don't have phones. How do you know what a number is? Seaweed dumplings. a special version. Increases base damage of a harpoon gun by 10%. Okay, that that makes sense. Sure. Oh, new animation.
food disappears once it leaves the water. Actually energizes you. Each dumpling contains different stuffing, so take your pick. The effects of seaweed dumplings dissipate when you leave the water. Oh, okay. Ah. Temporary boosts. Mima's dumplings can be ordered twice a day, once in the morning, once in the afternoon. Dumplings will give you a special effect that will last until you leave the water. Okay. Only one effect at a time. Cool. Seaweed farm, okay. Different seaweeds at Gumo's farm. Ow. Oh, okay. Special kelp. No seeds, okay. So, Poke, just out of curiosity, what kind of punishments were you thinking? Okay. I mean, I've seen things like, you know, spicy foods or um, horror games or things like that. I don't know. Great sword or a great axe? Um, hmm. I'm more partial to swords myself. Anyone have a, uh, like a special ability or anything like that? Anything magical on either one? Just melt that thick ice wall. Down we go. It's too cold. 
and kill for a hot bowl of miso soup from Bancho Sushi. Insane damage. Um... Yeah, I'm, I'm partial to swords myself, but I can actually see you with an axe more. Oh, what is that? I went too deep. I woke up in Eldritch Horror. Oh. Oh, I thought I killed it. your party members. Oh, I'm definitely going to have to upgrade my, uh, my harpoon gun. Mm -hmm. Is it dead end too? I'm almost there. I should check the surroundings first. Done, I might be able to do this. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. The lens collected frost. I need to clean the lens first. Really? You have to wipe off your camera? <laughs> That's funny. That is absolutely ridiculous. Get the mural. Oh, I took too long. Oh, uh, what even is this game? So that's for sure. Fish. Oh, okay. Another big old ice pillar. 
I'm gonna cause global warming trying to figure out why the water is getting too warm. Melting all this ice. Oh boy, a mirror puzzle. I haven't done a mirror puzzle in a long time. This wall is blocking the way. We can melt it using the divine tree fruit device. All right, there's blue. Yellow. Nachos, hydrate, okay. Glad this laser beam doesn't hurt. How's your Friday going? pretty good. Can't complain. I mean, I suppose I could, but it's not like it does any good. Oh, did you change your PFP? That is cute. You did not ish. Oh. Oh, I didn't notice. I was wondering why the name was purple. Okay. All right. Twelve light. Hey, no, no, it's no need to be sorry at all. I mean, I was just about to say, uh, introducing Nachos, the only otter so tall his shadow comes in first. You're all here as well. Take a picture, show it to Dr. Bacon. Fish. Oh, 
<laughs> oh no. Hmm, the mirrors here are not as aligned, not well aligned. Is there a way to align them? Looks like they slide. Also, I'm concerned with how much ammo is laying on the ground. Poke, why did Dave the Diver just turn into Laura Croft? This is nuts. Oh, okay. Boss is coming soon. There's an exact excessive amount of yeah ammo and health kits. That's why I'm concerned. While blocking the exit has melted away. Melt? Melted? Hmm. If I go past it, I will find the door to the glacial area. Ah, oh, this is really cold. I could go for a hot cup of green tea right now. So, one, Dave's really cold. Two, he always goes to food when he's cold. What do we got? Oh, it's super dark. All right, I hit this fruit and it glowed. I should use this. There's going to be a monster right behind me. Yeah, like that guy. Is that King Long? What is that thing? Like a, a Gadan is humongous. It's almost unreal. Oh, it's thankfully chained. Let me escape this place right in the current. I I think that might be King Long. Oh, cool. We got an escape scene. Shouldn't thing be able... To, that thing shouldn't be able to escape since it's so big. Now we just have to get out of this current. We're gonna die if we get caught. Let's run away.
Oh, he is catching or er, er, catching up to me. Oh, I got eaten. Boop. So much for my super chill game. This game goes from zero to sixty in about two and a half seconds. Oh, oh shit. Swim, Dave, swim. Oh no! <laughs> well, that was a blurt. Why didn't it post? Huh, that's weird. Home doesn't seem right. I think it's preparing an attack. What do I do? It's gonna fire the soul cannon. Oh, divine tree fruit. Hates light. So what if we hit it? Okay. Oh, is that what that does? Okay. I never figured out the counter before. Uh, dead end. There's no way out. Ooh, that was a close call. I think it fainted. I think it got knocked the fuck out. Path opened up after we hit. Let's run away before it wakes. Yes, deeper. Let's go deeper. <laughs> so wake already. What a disgusting creature. but it didn't post it in chat. Hmm. Running out of air. Oh, no. Next part of the blurb API interaction is not functioning as expected. Issue reported. Thank you, Nachos. Also, I was, I know you and I set up, um, Aura's walk-on, and I was trying, I checked it, he doesn't have one set, and I was trying to, but I couldn't get one to stick, so I'll have, I'll have to look that, at that later. I was just letting you know that that was an issue as well. Also, chat, if anybody else is interested in a walk-on, we do have that ability now, so, you know, feel free to submit them and we'll get them, get them looked at. Mm -hmm. 
Did you lose the creature in a straight line? No, I don't think you did. What is this vibration? Shouldn't let my guard down. Turn is flowing b back to the right. There should be a way out nearby. Run away before it wakes. And it's about time for round three. Here comes round three. Oh, we're doing. Oh, we're doing these. Oh, they went full battle toads on us. There's a light. Okay. So, just gonna say this. There may be a way out of the cave, but last time I checked, we were 500 meters below the surface of the ocean. There is no light down there. It ain't happening. Ooh, QTE. And they actually use QE. <laughs> I managed to escape. I'm going to barricade the entrance before Gadon comes after me. Now, if I nudge that pile of stones... trustworthy you would have already been eaten by the deep sea fish if I were not there for you oh is swam the secret uh, bad guy he seems incompetent the whole time but he's really the uh, the evil mastermind behind the whole thing that would be fun uh, I admit it this time thank you swam I'll go find out what's happening in the glacial area as you promised. I didn't imagine this place would be this cold. I'll freeze to death if I go down further. Oh, you helpless human. You do not have any gear or clothes to protect your body from the cold then? First, I must first return to Cobra and ask him. He may have something to protect me from the cold. We have no other option then. Let's return to the village. See that huge mirror in the back? Activated again. We'll be whisked away to the village. Pull the lever right. You pull the right lever. I pull the left one. Okay. Wow, that was... That was nuts. Oh. All these lovers at once on my signal. Oh. 
Now we can access this place straight from the village. Go back to the village, find a way to withstand the cold. Humans are so fat, fragile. This is something unthinkable for a superior warrior like me. Your tail has been shaking for some time now. Are you really all right? What are you talking about? You're clearly mistaken. So re return to the village for now. I guess Krill went up my nose. Yeah, I don't think there's Krill down there. I want to know how he got down there, though. Oh, you came. How was the glacial area? Um, there was a huge gadan in the passage, so... The glacial area is too cold for me to explore. I need something. Oh, uh, you're ill-equipped to explore the area for sure with your light diving suit. Our people wear clothes with divine free shirts and can withstand the can withstand the cold. I'm curious, can your people tailor the divine tree fruits cloths? Tailoring? Cobra or Dr. Bacon may know how. You seem to have talented friends. Take this cloth and ask your friends. I need to, t to tailor it into a suit. It may protect me from the cold. Cool. Find a human tailor or something for the task since your attire is different. Our attire is different from yours. I think he went around town saying he did it all by himself. Of course he did. Of course he did. He's incorrigible. Here comes the boop. Alright, so I need to go back to the surface. But if I just go back up to the surface, it'll be a pretty fruitless dive. So we're gonna swim up. We're gonna do this dive backwards. To be fair, I'm waiting for an event to come around. I need it for my next piece of the Griffin achievement. When you say piece of the griffin, are you thinking wing or leg? Uh, maybe shoulder? I hear those are pretty tender. It's the butt. <laughs> of course it is. Oh, you have that? Oh, really? Huh, you got the, uh, the golden, golden train, huh? That's cool. Wasn't something you were expecting. I mean, I've only ever seen it twice. It's the first time for me? Okay. I mean, I've never seen it in my channel. One was a, uh, a cute bunny and one was a uh, um, cotton candy cutie. Oh, 
Okay. Happy hunting. Grab some sea toads because now I have a sea toad recipe. Cucumber sea toad recipe. Three tooth puffer. I don't know if I need any more stargazers, so we are going to go try and grab one. Emergency evac. What we got here? Sea glide. Second sea glide. Jelly. Thank you.
Hi, Maddie. Or whoever's uh, impersonating Randy. The, the, the uh, chat or the API for the messages in chat aren't working for some reason, so. Now it's in. Oh, yeah, that's definitely Maddie. <laughs> Doesn't tell me, but definitely. Hi, hi. Happy Friday. <laughs> I'm doing pretty good. Um, yeah, just uh, doing so. I would say chill diving, but it hasn't been. Um, we got attacked by a giant zombie mermaid. Uh, but yeah. Having some fun. Hanging with chat. No complaints there. Shock Harpoon 3. Okay. How about yourself? How are you doing? some kind of virus oh no oh well, i hope you uh feel better quickly hopefully it's nothing too crazy air at me Don't <laughs> you love faith how you know is Maddie really a xenomorph did I not know that this whole time I mean, no judgments, no judgments. Oh no, that's a hammerhead. Okay. Hello. And I'm out of ammo.
All right. Did I see an escape pod thingy down here? Yep, right there. Okay. Oh, I got a new thing. Cool. Four hundred and fourteen meters down. Ooh, party! Oh, this Friday. Oh, everybody's back. Okay. Uh, we're just going to say okay so I can dispatch them out for something different. Often the kids with smaller fish, but stronger, bigger fish, it's easy to weaken them a bit first. If they're weakened, so it changes like ble bleeding or swaying. Okay. Speaking of which... Sniper. Can I upgrade shock again? No. I think you need an ot in a suit. Oh, okay. Well, uh, can I get a business suit? <laughs> or at least a tie? We might have to get creative for that one, Maddie. I mean, to be fair, shouldn't be. It shouldn't need to be that creative. What? What's? What's a tie other than a? A uh, super professional leash and choker. Just saying. Creative boobing for nachos. Would I like that idea? We'll see. We'll figure something out. Might take a hot minute, but we'll figure something out.
And yes, I'm on board for like creative booping for nachos. I just need to, uh, I have some ideas. Just need to see if I can get them to work like they look in my head. My stream said Arkan has played something. Did you guys hear something? Maybe it was super quiet. Poke name? Oh, we can do that. Made me double take if my Discord sounds on. <laughs> nice. <laughs> it's like, how the fuck did that turn on? <laughs> oh, I think it's I think it's awesome that Arkanos got everyone but me. Cause. Streamer mode doesn't let that happen. Also, even if it did, hello. Trying to do the events. Wow, you're cruising through those. <laughs> uh, is there anything I need to go down there for? I don't think I'd heard that one before. Alright, I think we're just going to go to the restaurant. <laughs> Never thought I'd say that for a sushi shop, but there, here we are. chat real wait oh we're just shy okay what fish
Pelican eel, that's what that was, okay. Oh no. Oh, okay. I'm like, oh no, I don't have much or all that much food to serve. We'll put the hammerhead on the menu. Only two of those. Sea toad. Bang tooth. Very cute pupper. Cuttlefish isn't great. Getting high. Oh, 51. Okay. need 10 shark heads to make this meal better. That's excessive. actually eat blobfish I hope that's enough food to last the service. Apparently I didn't do enough last time. Here we go. clean. Sounds about right. Good. Okay. Eh, good enough. Oh, 
not a bad run. Not a bad service. And a couple of people walk out angry. I need to focus on cleaning more, I guess. Chapter six, woo! Everything going well. Um, I opened the passage to the glacier area, but I can't explore the area because it's too cold. Oh, your current suit is not warm enough. I see. So the sea people gave me this cloth. I don't know how to use it. Cloth is warm to the touch. <clears throat> this is the breathing apparatus I found in the sea people's cave. Can make a cold resistant suit if I had a mechanical part that can patch up some items. Don't you have one from John Watson's suit? Actually, I brought some complex mechanical parts. Device may. This is a device that automatically adjusts water pressure. Might be able to do something with this. But. Too damaged to use without repair. Only I could find one intact somewhere. I'll tell you later this evening. I need to organize my thoughts. I have a bad feeling about this. Who doesn't? All right, yeah, do our social media because we have to. Has a new family. I'll take good care of them. Nice. Everybody likes cat pictures. All right, we have enough recipes. We need more best tastes and a lot more followers. Oof, that's a mood. Okay. Two weeds, gotta go take care of that. And we have an egg available. Five thousand. Not enough to upgrade anything. Okay. Need more deep water shark, I guess. Actually, I think we can go do some training. Wow, that's a big jump. Freaking plus, awesome. Thirteen hundred to train him again.
Serving plus. Really? That's interesting. He's almost better cooking than pie. Okay. I need to get this kid in the kitchen. Four seventy. Cooking plus plus. Sorry, Pi. Put a kid in the kitchen. I'm sure that's not illegal or anything. Ooh, pure cure, cure, cure is at 316. Maybe I'm using you in the wrong spot. Me so. my overhead oh no it's cute give it the high quality all right I just spent a whole bunch of money on training employing people is expensive. Oh cool, it's raining so I don't have to water them. Nice. But I do need to buy some more plots next time so I can um so I can uh, get some more uh, cucumbers going fast enough for the uh for the event. Oh wrong thing. Just trying to go to the boat. I also need to upgrade the interior. Why does everything cost money? Oh. 
Oh, I already talked about that one. Doll decoy. Interesting. Trigger bomb, nope. Yes. A narwhal? Bluefin tuna. And a thresher. Brown, I thought that was pink. Okay. Lightning Harpoon Mallet Go sleep Sleep. shells I need. It's only called a sea glide in Subnautica, but it's a sea glide. Other oh, skull. Wow, that's a lot of them. Ooh, olive oil. And uh, speaking of Subnautica chat, would you guys be interested in watching that? It's not, let's be honest, it's not my ideal game. I like the exploration games, but that game is Jump Scare Central. So, if you're interested, let me know.
Is that a black tip? It is. Grab the damn rock. figure out how to catch them alive. There's an air tank out here. Please, 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 please be an air tank out here. Five, four, oh, there's one. Three. Woo, that was cutting it close. That's another hammerhead, and I don't have any ammo. Let's go finish catching these guys. Hopefully they don't all reset when I go to a different region. Okay, the crabs didn't.
the problem with the uh what you call it with the uh, lightning hook is it just kills everything around them I don't know if that means you get less money or less happy customers if you use lower lower tiered food. I think there'd have to be some sort of uh, consequence. Oh, ow. Not good. There's ammo. There's air. This is exactly why I leave air tanks lying unless I'm uh, less than half. Okay. Nope, I have a lot of those. Well, only half a kilogram. Welcome back, chat. Come on. Some of these things are harder to make go to sleep than friendos and VRC. And yes, I know I'm calling myself out on that one too. If this little experiment is worth it, but there we go. Hmm. It's in a cave. I'm not likely to come back in here.
Now I'm overweight. Now I'm really overweight. Come on. I like that I don't need the UV lamp anymore. Ow. Hi, T. What do you mean later? I mean later today or tomorrow. Build shark, that'll work. Uh, I was figuring we'd probably stay with Dave the Diver unless uh, some group event or something came up. Use the uh, drone. We have a full inventory. Time to find a way home. How's it going today? How you doing, T? Been a minute. Oh, okay. Yeah, nobody does. That can be very frustrating. Right, where is... Crab there. Need to find an escape pod. Probably should be going up, not down, but. Ooh, one of those. Kinda wish I would have saved the drone now. Leave you alone. Don't you all want to leave me alone? I see how it is. There we go, escape pod.
All right. Not exactly a super uh, effective run. Hi, Teo. He cute. Are you standing in front of a mirror again? Because yes, you are very cute. Oh, well, thank you. You're very sweet. How's your Friday going? Level four, finally. Just waking up. Oh, too early to tell. Gotcha. Alright, so I only need leg bones and sea grapes, but I haven't been able to see find sea grapes in like several chapters. I'm doing good. Just uh doing some diving, escaping from giant zombies, uh hanging out with chat. You know, typical Friday. What are these? Sheep's head and striped catfish. Yeah, it's pretty chill. I mean, the zombie escape wasn't, but uh, the rest of it's super chill. I think this model is a little too big in its macro. Hello. I look like a shark. <laughs> I'm not, but I look like one. Uh, afternoon, afternoon. I can't go through the glacier yet, so I guess we just dive again. Okay. Two and a half minutes. Doing pressure. Yep, big bad wolf. <laughs> I can't even. Oh, there you are. I say, I can't even see chat. I can't even see you. Hello. Oh, 
Oh good, more salt. I wouldn't think that salt would be a super hard commodity to come across. Oh, there's another one. Okay. Oh, I didn't get the head? Okay, fine. I got plenty of air this run. Quite possibly. Usually happens when you uh, spam every redeem. Uh, I don't know yet though. Ah, I didn't see the, uh, the pets. Thanks for the pets, Teo. They were off the screen, I didn't see them. And that was one heck of a charge. Ow. Uh-huh. They, they still have to resolve tea. So they, that's why he went down and then back up and all that stuff. Hi, Death! Oh, sea grapes! Wheat! How's your Friday going? So now's the real test. T. We'll find out when this one wears off. Do we go back to normal? Do I stay down here? Or go back to big? Who knows? Oh, an angler. I haven't seen one of you in a long time. Well, you wouldn't be the only one. couple of friends who come in here and uh, first thing they do is I'm gonna break things but I mean in the end of the day it's not like it really hurts anything so I just might have to uh, reset the program if it uh, if it is too distracting or prevents other people from using it It's up to chat. Not up to me, it's up to chat. The funny thing is, 
Yeah. So right now, this, this is the micro level. If this sets as default and you use micro on it, it gets smaller. Oh, hello, tiger. Oh, I just backed myself into a, toy, oh, a corner with a tiger shark. Ooh, safety hound. Oh wow, that's that's an interesting look. Big head safety hound. All right, we got down to the depths now. That doesn't really help me. We'll grab the air after we take care of the fang tooth. But yeah, to give you a better answer to your uh, question from earlier, T, I extended out all the uh, the timers because uh, it wasn't really worth it for a couple of seconds here, a couple of seconds there. So. I made all the redeems last longer. Oh, there's a shark. Mega mouth, it looks like. Jellies are heavy for jellyfish. Chuck harpoon, that'll help. Yep, make a mouth.
Down we go. Are mine. Other Sea Glide. Oh, Cookie Cutter Shark. Nice. Diamond. Hmm. Not entirely sure. Depends on, uh, I guess, depends on its state. Did we hit the bottom? We did. Okay. A seaweed farm down here now makes me wonder do i have to weed the seaweed seaweeds
Alright, everything got, uh... Everything got done. Good. I guess I could go back at any point. Oh, okay. Might as well. I'm not over full, but I'm definitely full. Oops. Wrong portal. Oh, welcome back, chat. Ooh, new uh, thresher tail or something like that. Hmm, okay. Oh, this guy? Okay. What monster you got for me to find now? Nasty storm today. Oh, you again? Looking for a super rare boss card as usual? Felt an energy of something extremely powerful today. Vortex, remember the vortex. Yeah. Storm is uh, gaining strength. All right, well, I guess we're going after another Vortex. So what's the idea you mentioned earlier? Oh, that. What if you infiltrated the sea blue base and retrieved the mechanical part? Ah, uh, that sounds like a horrible idea. Sea Blue folks were scouting the area using underwater drones at night. Follow the drones and you will find their base. Sounds very dangerous. I will prepare an infiltration suit with camouflage patterns. Will hide you from uh, plain sight at night. No guarantees though. What do you mean rip, T? I ain't gonna die. Anyway, it's not dark enough yet, so I'll see you later when I cl close the bar. Really? Come harvest? Okay. I guess we're going to go harvest. I guess we're going to do a night dive after the uh, restaurant closes. Oh, you mean the micro? Oh no, we lost a cucumber.
six? Yeah, we'll do six. All right, there we go. Time to go make some sushi. Oh yeah, it's VIP day. We're gonna be on TV. Hello everyone, this is Yui from the NDC station. Ladies and gentlemen, as you know, today is the day of the showdown and challenge the chef. Bancho, are you ready? Of course. And Wang Pang. The same, I can't wait. Excellent. Let's begin the challenge to the chef now. Oh, nice. New video. Oh, wait, what? Yeah, it's very new. Okay. Pancho will compete with the famous chef on the TV, new TV show. Let's bring him the ingredients he asked for. Oh, I get it. All right, this is new. Oh, S, S. QTE, okay. Coat the fish with starch. <laughs> this is a thing. Oh, this is so weird. Oh, we're just aiming for the sweet spot. I really thought it'd get uh, faster as it got closer. Stir fry and sauce. Okay.
Oh, I get it. Okay. It was very, uh, OJT. I gotta say, one of them looks better. <laughs> Momo. We win. 99 to 94. Oh, wow. I don't know I lost, but I'm the best chef in Hong Kong. Of course, we're not in Hong Kong. The dish was excellent. He used the finest ingredients for, the, for flawless taste, but it wasn't good enough to impress me. A bunches dish. Gave me a whole new experience with a fish called Stargazer. To be honest, it was my first time tasting the fish. Bancho gave me a perfect blend of interesting and fresh taste of a Stargazer. The classic taste of sweet and sour sauce. We're only talking about the taste. Yours was better, Wang Peng. But I highly admire Bancho's attempt to present a foreign taste in a familiar way. My final verdict is Boncho. Yay! Oh, Vincent clearly explained the reason for his decision. Boncho wins the match. Boncho, what are your thoughts? Oh, well, my thoughts? I wanted to present the... Thank you! <laughs> the champion saves words for more action, and we love it. Today's winner of Challenge the Chef is Boncho, the defending champion. What a competition. What a judgment. See you next time. This was, was Reporter Yui. I should try voices sometimes. That'd be horrible. Amazing, Boncho. You bested Wang Peng in his area of expertise. Mm, who cares about nationality when it comes to food? Flavor is fair game. I do have a feeling the show, that the show will return again. But I have full confidence in your victory. Speaking of the contest, I got some inspiration for Chinese cuisine while preparing for the competition. I will write them down. Help me try some new... Something new when you have time. Alright. Uh-oh. I can do that one. I can do that one. I'm glad these uh, these little cutscene things aren't super long. They're, I mean, they've got a couple they cycle through. They do get a little repetitive, but they're not super long, so they don't kill the momentum of everything. And like the the new ones, are all super flashy, so they're they're super fun. Ooh, I can enhance the sea toad. Four hundred and sixteen dollars for one dish. Yeah, we're gonna do that.
512. Ooh, but the thing is coming up. Worth it. Okay, I gotta get more sea toads in the next day or so. Alright, so I also need a whole bunch more cucumber. That one may have been a mistake. Two Ooh, sea grapes. Sailfish on the menu. I mean, that seems a lot bigger than it normally is. I'm gonna stick my head up in the clouds. I should uh, make belly rubs to redeem as well as a head pat. Four eighty-seven. Okay. Without resetting, how do you fix it? You don't. Uh, I need to either... Um, 103, we'll put that on the menu. Uh, I need to either uh, reset the program or see if I can just send this, the off signal again. You've had your fun? Well, I'm glad you had fun. That's what it's there for. Ooh, real shark. Okay, we'll throw that on there. I mean, I added the global cooldowns to try and mitigate that a little bit, um, but and the uh, the purpose of it isn't isn't to just break right away. But you guys are pretty uh, determined sometimes, so oh oh, there we go. I guess that one was just longer. Copper shark, throw that on there. And... Fifteen seconds for the redeem, huh? Oh, for the cooldown. Hammerhead. Is that already on the menu? I don't think so. Okay. I have a couple other things that I've been working on. 
Um, they're not quite done yet, but a couple other new redeems that'll be coming up here soon. Uh, it's different for each one. Um, the other is usually right at the bottom uh, or the bottom message. I think the uh, free count is a little taller than that. Oh, why am I all the way over here? bunch of money that night. What was that, eight grand? <laughs> About to say normal size, but chibi now. Oh, this is way, uh, way small. Just taking up less screen. Should be enough. It's so dark. You sure there's something there? Put on this infiltration. You help you stay unnoticed. That's closer to normal size. Feel like I'm being a secret agent. I almost added again to that for some reason. Best for success. You look ready to enter Dark Moses Island in that. I don't know, T. I didn't reset anything last time, so we'll see. In the water, you'll see the roaming drones underwater. Follow them unnoticed, I bet they'll lead you to Sea Blue's base. Leave your weapons here. Ah, uh, what? I mean, infiltrate their base unarmed. Sea Blue runs tight security system with sentry drones and sensors. One of those drones detects a weapon that will alert the base immediately. It's a covert operation anyway. Going in secretly and coming back with a mechanical part. Simple, right? What am I doing here? Skipping sleep. Oh, how many times have I said that? All right, here we go. It's a secret agent, man. Want to be this one of Sea Blue's sentry drones? Follow it from a distance. The GB reset? Yep. Oh, I knew there'd be sharks when I didn't have any weapons. Ow. 
Ow. No weapons is one thing, but no tools, no sea glide. I knew I uh, that was the door. There's micro. Oh, a hidden entrance. I should hurry before the door closes. Isn't this too, be too big to be a hidden base? What are these facilities for? Machines processing dolphin meat? I'm confused. Aren't sea blue environmentalists? What in the world are these for? I must find some mechanical parts for now. Special suit components from the top floor. Be careful not to get caught by soldiers or cameras. I'm sure that guy's gonna come back. Yep, there he is. This game has so many different play modes, it's weird. You didn't see nothing. Nothing there. Go on, purple, purple hat. Go on, turn around. Still nothing there. me I'm not a guy I'm just a bag of trash over here all right the longer you stay in there the uh, harder it is to get moving again Dang it. That is so tight. He can't see me there. All right, 
right, top floor. I'm not sure who's over there, but I'm sure this box is here for a reason. Military rations, okay. Looks like an office. Looks like it contains some mechanical parts here. Man, I miss my worn clean bed at home. Quit whining, Dave. Keep the sea blue poster. I can't believe what they're doing behind everyone's back. The drawing of the sea blue research. Wait, isn't this a picture of me? Core component of sea, sea blue tech suit. Looks quite complicated. Oh, here it is. Let me take it. I'm gonna get caught. I knew it. Nice. All right, T, now I think you broke it. Even Dave seems smaller. Oh, I thought you were going to try micro again. Oh, Dave, you came back in one piece. Well, I sense a lack of trust in your voice regarding my survival skills. <laughs> Come on, take a look at this thing. Sea Blue's mechanical part in pristine condition. Why didn't you warn me of the armed pirates? Honestly, I didn't know of their presence. Anyway, found many pieces of equipment used to process and freeze fish at Sea Blue's base.
Sorry about that, chat. I was just talking with Cola about um, some different stream mechanics and stuff like that. Found many pieces of equipment. Okay. And I believe they caught some dolphins as well. Isn't Sea Blue a group of environmentalists? Doesn't that make them hypocrites? Did you fix it? Um, possibly? I guess it looks like it. I guess we'll see uh, if it um, if it changes state here in a couple of minutes. But it looks like uh, it looks like it's back to normal. Well. Knowing they've been exposed might make them more dangerous. You better be careful. Anyway, get some rest. It's getting late. I'll talk to Dr. Bacon tomorrow. Went home late and couldn't sleep well last night. Yeah, good job last night. Let's go report to Dr. Bacon. You got it? Nice. Congrats, Delta. Hey, Dave. And you required some in, an intact, intact mechanical part. Why can't they just call it intact suit or something? Yes, with difficulties. Here, take it. Yes, this is it. Good job, Dave. Okay, now I have everything I need. I'll go to the lab and craft a cold resistant suit. But I'm worried about the fact that the glacial area is unstable. I suggest you get a good weapon as well as a good suit. New material developed at the lab. Dive knife can be upgraded. As usual, uh, you can upgrade it through iDiver. Nice! Upgrading the dive knife not only increases its attack power, but all, it can also mine materials that pre previously could only be mined with a pickaxe. Oh good, I don't have to switch, uh, switch utility or utensils anymore. The new DMs? Oh, okay. Ooh, pretty. That's a sharp looking griffin. Is that everything you dreamed? Everything you hoped? It looks badass. Give me a day to craft the suit, and I'll see you tomorrow. Cold resistant suit. I wonder what that'll look like. Like Dr. Bacon said, a suit won't be enough to protect yourself. Don't you think you should bring a weapon? A glass stuff. Oh, cool. See people's workshop. Okay. All right. So it's first thing in the morning. We gotta run to the farm. I haven't used the fish farm at all. I should probably start using that a little bit more. Alright, so I have 9,300. I 
air tank. Dive knife level two. Oh, it upgrades it a lot. Or the harpoon gun. I could go sell some stuff and upgrade that harpoon gun. I think we're gonna do that. My harpoon gun felt slightly anemic last time. But autos farm fish are said to be of high quality when it's not convenient to fish stop by the fish farm. Yeah, that's true. Delta, it should be pretty good. I, it took you all day to get it. Well, all day today, plus several other days of prep and grinding and work. Ugh, work. Hello. There we go. All right, so I'm supposed to call Duff. Can you go? Stuff man. Okay. I'm gonna explore the glacier area, and I'm not sure if the weapon I have will be enough. Ah, okay. oh, the huge glacier in the deep sea. I've heard about your mission. I've planted a tracker in the gun. Okay. The only one I can craft now with the ingredients I have is not that will not be that different. Unless I can get some of my hands on some new minerals. You now you uh, frequent the Sea People Village. Why don't you look for new materials there? Speaking of the village, I wonder how the Sea People Workshop is going. Mm -hmm. I should pay to visit. Can I call them? Vincent's still eating it, even after Phil and Wing has stopped. He must have really liked it. So I was going to go sell some stuff. How many silver bowls and junk do I have? And that'll be enough. Sweet. 
super alloy harpoon gun. Max level. Okay. Cool. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go shop again, and go to sell. Opal, diamond. No, I don't have any enough of anything to, uh, to get the the part I, or enough money to upgrade the dive knife. So I guess we're just gonna go dive. Just checking on some chat one quick second. I do apologize. are grown come harvest you harvest what do i pay you for oh i don't pay you oh that's fine two cookie cutters okay
hit this first. Oh, five seaweed. I'm gonna go get more uh, seaweed seeds or some sort of seeds. Blacksmith! Still not feeling well. Good enough to reopen the workshop. What do you sell? Right, war, right, da, ba, 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 ba. Let's try that again. Well, I have a wide variety of m minerals available. I give you a good deal on them. If you know someone who knows what to do with minerals, it'd be good to bring them to them. Oh, and find something in the sea, bring it to me, and I'll buy it at a good price. Sure, I'll stop by your place before going up. Anyway, it's good to know that you're getting better. I'll keep in touch. You now purchase ingredients from Dua's workshop to enhance weapons. Dua would exchange certain ingredients for Bay. Lava. Root fragment. Ice diamond. Oh, wow. Now to clean all the sand out of my armor. Nice. I did that. I guess I'll go hunt some deep sea stuff. I don't know to notice too much of a difference with the harpoon gun. Oh, hostile.
All right, I guess I'll catch a bunch of comb jellyfish. Wish I could get them at a higher uh, quality, but we'll take what we can get. soon enough. Alright, so they're obviously trying to get me to do a whole bunch more with, like, the mineral trade. Do a bunch more mining, which I've done a lot of ignoring uh, here recently. to make a whole bunch of money keep up upgrading my uh dive gear i need to upgrade the farm um ow too fast on that. from having none of that to having like all of that. trying to go up not down so that's that seems to be the wrong way
wonder how many of these fish I have to catch before I kill my space bar. Do that one because that was a big seller the other day. These flasks have to be good for something more than three, three coin. Looking for some uh, cookie cutter sharks. anything other than a whale skeleton. There's a frilled shark. I wonder if I can kill a frilled shark with a rock. Oh, well, I did 30 damage to it. So my harpoon gun does more than a boulder. Good to know. There we go. Oh, I went right by that. 
I don't think it really matters now. Flame Harpoon, tier 3, nice. Oh, that's a new type of mineral. How do you know when we're talking over the phone? Because I installed a CCTV on your boat. Oh, that guy's creepy. Anyways, I'll work on a new weapon when the mineral arrives. I'll add the ingredients I need to the list, secure them, let me know. Eagerly, I eagerly wait for the never before seen minerals to arrive. Oh, I got a thing. Neat. New gun list. You now, you now create weapons with the Sea People's materials. Visit the workshop at the Sea People's Village. Find about new materials available. Sweet. Finally. Oh, what are you? Oh, it's a comb jelly thingy. Nice. Let's see here. Oh. So let's go look and see what we got. Oh, hello. Okay, sniper. Death sniper rifle. Okay. So I have one of these. I need one of these to make one of these. Okay. Flame rifle, flame rifle two, explosive sniper rifle. Tranquilizer, poison, poison two, hell poison. Okay. Or bagel, or beagle shark. I've never heard of that. Okay. Oh, I need both a lightning two and a shock two and an opal tube and three shark teeth and 5,500 gold. Sniper rifle that inflicts electric damage and shock damage. Highly effective groups. Against groups of enemies. Transfers 45% of damage taken to nearby targets up to five times. Shocks targets for 3.5 or 0.35 seconds. Increases movement speed by 45%. Damn. That's fun. And I can't look at these without crafting the other ones. Opal ore, almost have enough for that. Alright. Rifle. 
Thunderbolt rifle, hell poison. Okay, those are the same as the snipers. Okay. Uh, I can't just exit out. Alright, I need cookie cutter sharks, and I think that's it right now. I just need money. Oh, yeah, we got the um, cucumber event coming up, too. Let's go check the farm. Well, actually, I can check it from here. Rice is harvestable. Cucumbers are growing. Okay. Harvest complete. In zero days, okay. So we'll get that later today. Can't go through the glacier yet, either. Hmm. Yeah. Thank you so much for the follows. Thank you for the five tier ones, Timo. I should have gone to the, uh, looking for the Vortex last night. Oh, dang it, wrong way. Oh, well, well, I guess we're going for a swim. All right, cat food. Suppose it's not bad to go through and just go pick up some stuff.
Oh, dang it. Oh, wow, this guy's resilient. There we go. So I got the, uh, got the ammo replenished. Poison tube, no thanks. Sleep. There you go. Oh, hey. There we go. That worked. Come on. Lots of squeaking. So much squeaking. That's not horrible. Ah, that was dumb. I shouldn't have picked that up. I don't need any shells. But there are a couple of urchins down here. side of the hole. Got some air.
There are a bunch of sharks up here this time. I didn't realize the hammerheads are moving in to stay. Some ammo, another shrimp. Let's down into the deep. I never did find any more of those sea grapes. Like? No, of course not. Also gonna take me down to the hole, yep. Oh wait. There we go, we got a live one. Oh no, we can't can't capture it like that. bomb I don't have a lot of commentary right now chat I'm just kind of trying to build up some resources get through the day um before we can actually go on and uh progress a little bit go for uh, some more mining I guess I can do is uh, send a uh, 
ba, 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 send a uh, shark up with the drone. shark for that though That's easy to walk away from. I have a lot of that. Soy sauce, I have a decent amount of that, I think. There's got to be an escape pod point here somewhere. We can move on. Dispatch.
Oh, I can't use that yet? Okay. Okay. We do a night dive. A bunch of sharks and eels. That'd be tempting. Yeah, we'll do a night dive. Oh wait, I think we make more money if we just go do the sushi thing. Let's go find out. Oh, they're back. Alex the Fish Fryer! Hello everyone, this is Yui from NDC Station. Good to see you again. I'm Vincent Yamamoka. Yama... Yamaoka. Yamaoka. Uh, here he is, appearing out of nowhere again. Previous episode of Challenge the Chef was as hot as molten lava. It's truly an interesting development. Today's episode, a new challenge appears. Let me introduce you to Alex Cooper, cooks a platinum rated chef from the United Kingdom. Aww. Must be the sushi, sushi chef who beat Wang Peng in the last competition, yes? <laughs> I expected a fancier restaurant than this. Your establishment is humble indeed. Challenger is provoking the champion. This will be an exciting match. Today's theme is Fry the Sea. Both Japan and the United Kingdom are popular for their fried dishes. Dishes may look similar, but are authentic in each in their own way. Whose dish will please the palate of Vincent, the judge? Can you guess the winner? My mouth is watering already. Like before, you have two days, I repeat, two days to compete. Dear audience, this match will be fire. Uh, stay tuned and see what transpires in today's Challenge the Chef. Wow, the guy's not pretentious at all. Oh, it's it is an easy one this time. Your fried sea breams and black tiger shrimp will win the day easily. My choice is deep sea fish. They're well known recipes, and I don't want to just re replicate the tastes. Took up the kitchen knife to explore new ingredients and taste of the sea. Flesh of deep sea fish is usually soft and gelatinous. I will fry it, fry it and harden it to add flavor and texture. Mm -hmm. You're not familiar with deep fish recipes, but if Vincent doesn't like your dish, mm -hmm. don't worry. We'll pick the best deep sea dish. Today's main ingredients are 
cookie cutter sharks, vampire squids, and binocular fish. I haven't even seen a binocular fish. Line up is quite ambitious. Well, I trust your hunch, Buncho. I'll try to secure them. Oh, barrel eye. Okay. So I have all but the barrel eye. What do we got? Well, we're going to save the cucumber because tomorrow is cucumber day and I can't grow anymore. And they're not exactly cheap, so should be fine. Hi, Chi. Thanks for the pets. Oh, you're so sweet. How was your Friday? Hope you had a good end of your week. It was good. That's good. Glad to hear it. Spider crab? Okay. Um, no, because I have a good spider crab dish up here. That one. Okay. Sweet toad, comb jelly. That's not much of an increase for 22 of them. Gazer. All right, so let's start with some frog shark. that one do some thresher might as well throw some hammerhead on there well I'll throw the nautilus on there for something cheap Just one though, but why not?
the barrel jelly. Ooh, there we go. Throw that one on there. All right. All right, here we go. Make some sushi. It's not very fast on dry land. I can respect that though. Some wasabi. Hi, Rapid. Welcome on in. How's your Friday? Chat, you ever sometimes just feel larger than life? Thousand, damn. Is that a kilt, kilt, skirt, a little column A, a little column B. We can go with kilt. But it doesn't have pockets, so I don't know if it qualifies. But yeah. Party up. Finally, we get some progress. Not easy crafting a suit in one day. But I am me, so I did it. That looks nice. Go ahead and try it on. Oh, that suits you well. Size is perfect as well, thank you. Feels warm. Maybe it's, it's made from the divine tree fruit cloth. Hydrate. Okay, Delta. Did you get all the sand out of your armor? That suit, you can not only roam underwater, but also cold places freely. No? Oh, no. Good. Time to go to the glacial area. Cold resistance suit protects you from the cold environment of the glacial area. 
upgrade it further to dive even deeper. Oh, there's more upgrades. Okay. Party day today. Prepare the right ingredients to make a fortune. Okay. Eight hundred meters? Holy crap. So we're gonna go do the... Increases the number of minerals that can be mined. Oh, nice. Can I do that again? 7,200. Not yet. Oh no, one pest damage, that's not good. An egg, okay. It's not going to be done today, is it? <laughs> I was wondering when somebody was going to throw that one at me. So skirt it is, yeah. Apparently killed Stu require pockets, I think. How many mounts are there, Delta? Sorry, you get regular food this time, kitten. Nine? And how many do you have? Eight? You can go with from Mount Withdrawal when, uh, when you run out. Oh, five. Okay. Oh, four? Oh. Slacker. There we go. 
All right. Schedule a party. Yep. Parties today. I know. And I have like a day to go find a barrel eye. It should be down in the glacier, I think. Your fifth one is new yet. Okay. Entered the glacial passage for the first time. Um, no, we killed this thing last time. This is not the first time. Lightning triple axle. Wow, okay. There's a whole bunch of uh, fish down here. Whole bunch of brand new fish. fish okay arctic cod the music down here S sounds like grr time to explore the area Stuff. North Pacific Sea Star. Oh, yeah. I mean, Div had some good lines, too. 
but uh, not not as much as Gur. Yes or no? Um, as long as it doesn't hurt yourself or anyone else, uh, yes. Model fix? It seems to be. Jade marble, nice. Oh, you're thinking about making an otter? Oh, that's a poisonous octopus. That sucks. Okay. I mean, yeah, that's that's fair rapid. I have quite a few different models. Um, lots of them are not in VRM form yet. Um, and hopefully I can get that fixed here soon. But I mean, it's fun being an otter. It is. Oh, we finally found a narwhal. Cool. Um, Rabbit, just a thought. Um, I'm not f sure if you're familiar with Mikey Bunny, but his avatar is a uh, is a bunter, uh, bunny otter hybrid. So, you know, that might be something uh, something you might be interested in. I don't know. Um, but if you're looking for someone to do customizations, uh, 
Ola does that very well. He did my my otter and his otter and quite a few of them now. So um, he's really good at that. Yeah, yeah, um, that's what I was just thinking. It is pretty exclusive, but I don't think it's like, I think. It's harder to, it's not like you can just go to Gumroad and buy the Otter, but I don't, I didn't know if it was like ultra limited edition or whatever else, but um, yeah, it's, it's a thing. Take. Was it exclusive or no? Um, well, there's like four of them in existence, and uh, the creator doesn't sell it, as far as I understand. Um, but I don't know if if you could, if it's possible to talk to them and get one or whatnot. Oh, we got the picture, so it's moving away. Okay. And apparently, people can still read things. So, like, for me, a big thing is uh, last minute changes. Thanks for doing the uh, shout out, Chi. And wear me a little bit, especially when you have stuff planned for a week and then all of a sudden things change. And I try not to let that get to me, but that gets to me. So. Even in such a cold place, there's still something for such a big creature to eat. Deep sea is really a mysterious place. I need to get better at the uh, shout outs. I need to look, uh, look into the auto ones. I like the Eclipse integration, but center screen might be a bit much. Yeah, I wasn't sure. I just uh, wasn't sure where to put it. I kind of wanted to highlight uh, people, and it seemed neutral to, um, for everything or all the different games. I might move it up to a corner or something like that, because it's only up there for 30 seconds max. Um, but you're right, it could, uh, could take away from from what we're doing in the moment. Can't go down further now. Oh, some heat coming, okay. It went from too cold to too hot. Apparently 500 meters is not deep enough. Or 540 meters is not deep enough.
How does black vinegar even get down here? Hmm. But yeah, Natchez is absolutely right. Uh, one Mikey's uh, model is super cute as it is, but yeah, he's uh, he's rocking the cooler retexture. What is that? Oh, biscuits. Fuck, 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 fuck. Holy shit, that guy came out of nowhere. And I think that might be the second biggest shark I've uh, caught. Everything's hostile down here. Okay. Oops. I see. Oh, there's a mirror to head back. Okay. These things freeze up, so you can't just pop back here. All right, let's try this again. Starry skate. Okay. Uh, wielding a frozen cod. Oh shit, narwhal! Narwhal with no bullets! You know what? Yeah. Time to science the shit out of this. See if I can go to the village and then come back down here. Okay. Alright, all the cold uh, icy water is getting to me. I need to take a quick bio break. I will be right back. Uh, two quick minutes, chat.
All right, chat. Sorry about that. Wait, I'm back. Let me get back to the game screen here. There we go. Okay, so I can pop back and forth. Nachos, I'm having a hard time remembering. How long have you been officially cute for? When did that end? Oh wait, I'm gonna go to the restaurant. Alright, she enjoy your lurk. See who used that. But yeah. I hope everybody's having a good Friday. I hope everybody's got a lot of fun plans for the weekend. I just realized I was asking not just questions. He probably is off on his way to his weekend plans. Isn't it? What time is it? I don't know. It's a time. Chat, would you believe I don't have a clock near my desk? And it's kind of hard to switch off the game to look at the, uh, look at the, uh, taskbar so yeah i don't have a clock it could be two it could be three it could be 17. i don't know There's some roots. There's that damn narwhal, and I still don't have ammo. Hmm, a door. slab with text in front of the door should take a picture of it and do ask dr bacon to decipher oh oh the return of the safety hound hello show it to Dr. Bacon.
Ice fish. go after that narwhal. I have no ammo. Caitlin, huh? Okay. These ancient creatures they have must, must have been released from the melting glacial ice. I wonder if any any those are of any use to Boncho for his sushi place. I'll bring him some samples. Oh man. Look, ancient creatures that have thawed from the ice. Can I eat it? That, that's literally what, what just came about from that. Come on, come on up. Oh wow, that's a lot of exposed uh, rock. Very human response, it very much is. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. So much open water here, too. That is insane. It's very, very pretty. Oh, God, that's a big ass shark. Nope, we gotta just turn around and nope out of here. of the way and then we'll head back
definitely gonna need to, uh... I'm gonna need to upgrade my dive knife to get some more minerals. Oh, back to party up. Hi, Leroy. <laughs> Dr. Bacon, could you take a look at this picture? Oh, an ancient southern slab of the sea people. Very old and poorly weathered. No matter, it should be enough to run the decoding equipment with. Hold that picture for a moment. Oh, okay. Song's got some pretty good energy. Ninety nine. Oh, it's up here. There we go. Oh, that ends so abruptly. God, I can read them. How lucky. What does it read? Seems to be some sort of spell. Letters are unfamiliar to me, so it's hard to decipher them clearly. Why don't you ask the sea people? There must be someone who has... Uh... Knowledge of cryptolo cryptography or spells. So what you're saying is, is I should figure out how to make my avatar dance. Okay. We can do that. Oh, that was a uh, poor beagle shark. Okay. Udo, you brought me a picture of something. Can I see? A giant jellyfish. That goes look like a lion's mane. You hear something growling? Just kidding, you can't hear anything underwater. That's not true. Put your picture good good use. You can always hear horny jail underwater. Sure the readers will love it. Nice! Photo spots all over the place. Thank you for your help. Keep up with good work. <laughs> oh, it's Friday. That means I have to go hunting for a picture tomorrow. I also need to go find a barrel eye.
<laughs> oh, <laughs> I got you some sea grapes, but we eated it. Be back later, gonna take a nap. All right, enjoy your nap. Have a good sleep. Okay, so found a jade marble. Now we need to find a uh Oh, take no chicken. Nice. Dangerous gemstones. Bring a narwhal to the surface. Oh, geez. Okay. That's far too short. It really is. 100% is. You get 500 more. I could upgrade my... Uh... Oh, but I could also do my dive suit. Yeah, let's see if we can't go a little deeper. Oh, that's max level. Okay. Oh, I forgot about this song. That's also way too short. you got oh still not sensor trap nice wow I wonder if we have to use this to catch the narwhal. It's going to make me turn back again. I'm really surprised that it, uh, he doesn't take an extra like magazine or something for his rifle. to see people about that tablet. I'll do it later. I'm sure it'll be fine. Hush guard.
Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Why do sharks in this game always make me sound like Morty? Oh gosh. Oh jeez. Is that a shark, Rick? Oh gosh. Oh, he died. Yeah. Leafy Sea Dragon. More black vinegar. The mayonnaise in a glacier. I have so many questions. I really don't know if I want the answers. my dude there you are oh whoa gotcha aha bye bye I'm surprised nobody played the uh, Narwhal song. Narwhal, Narwhal, swimming in the ocean. <laughs> I was actually looking for a blurb for it. That is definitely fair. 507 Got some more headache. Actually, I'm gonna collect some more of that Maybe this one away. Never mind <laughs> Oh, it's so big I don't, know, I don't know what you are, but I'm gonna shoot you. I got it. I don't know what it is, but I killed it. I'm sad now. Greenland shark. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Ban Maddie. Oh, I still can't go further down.
Underwater rifle. Oh, nice. Level five. I didn't know there was a level five. A nachos. We can't ban Maddie just because he's a xenomorph. We get in trouble for stuff like that. Oh, Cola, that might have been the uh, the noise you were hearing earlier. The back, back and forth um, button mash. I present to you, Horn! Scream. Alright, we're not using that one for the dump scare. It was, uh, wasn't bad enough. I mean, yeah, that's a good one. Let's use that one. It's totally bad enough. Totally. Oh, I died. Dang it. I need you alive. There we go. Alright, so I think we gotta go and talk to the book lady. The book fish lady. The fish book lady? Ah, the one person. What about you? Can I use you? No. Mining level too low. I'm gonna go up here. Swan is gone again. Suwan, are you reading a book? Are you surprised my key analytic abilities come from the books I read? A long time no see. I was sorting books. How can I help you? Take a look at this picture. Looks to be like an ancient spell, but I can't understand what it means. <coughs> I can roughly understand it. Where was this stone slab located? In front of a large closed store in the glacial area. Let's see, according to the book, there are three large stores in the glacial area. Inside those stores is a switch that will lead to the Divine Tree Control Room. I did an analysis and found that the earthquakes are caused by the Divine Tree Control Room. Activate all three switches and you should be able to access the Divine Tree Control Room. That's not going to be easy. How am I supposed to open the big door? I have materials referring to the door. Let me see. Here it is. 
You need to cast a spell to open the door. Oh, we get magic? Okay. Fish magic! Fish magic! I'm gonna get out. Water bending. I don't speak the language of the tea, people. Oh, of course not. Then why don't you bring Swam with you then? Uh, Swam, you say? You can do nothing without me. Well, it looks like you're in trouble. I'll give you a hand this time. Not sure about this. Best of luck to you. May King Long's protection be with you. Stop worrying about me. Just lead the way, human. This dude is going to freeze his tail off. Do we got to swim there? Are we just going to show up there? Just show up there. Hmm, this must be the door. I'm supposed to cast the spell Niamo taught me. Watch and learn. Is that a walk like an Egyptian? Wow, oh, the door really opened. I am impressed. Now you realize my greatness. I hope he gets uh, grabbed from whatever's inside. Said it was a spell and you had to dance as well to open it. Oh, that is, I need to dance to keep with the beat. Got it. Shall we get inside and check out the place? Um, my waist hurts from the dance. Unfortunately, you'll have to go alone today. SMH, my head. There we go. Must be a switch to operate the divine tree control room inside. Why does the tree have a control room? I got a feeling as this passage will cause me trouble, but I have no other choice. I need to be careful. First glacial cave. We got a box on it. And a turnstile. piece of strange rotating equipment is blocking my way. I think I can start it myself. Oh, the equipment is working. And the stake began to move. I must avoid them. Yeah, it's a turnstile. Another jade marble. Ow. Passage down is blocked here. Passage down there is blocked by ice. I should do something with this rotating equipment. Is that a a plinko or a pinball game? Oh, there's the plate I need. Hmm. What 
am I doing? Oh, okay. Hi, Mr. Bangi. Okay. How's it going? How was your week? Nice is broken. Time to go down. Oh. We're going to grab some air first. Just in case. I really don't see myself swimming back up here for it. Not too bad, that's good. Enjoy your lurk. Thanks for swinging by. Oh, those those are hostile. Telescope fish, huh? Telescope fish are hostile. Yes. Okay. There's another jade plate. Alaska Pollock, okay. Suppose not the weirdest thing to find on a glacier. Save some open uh, inventory space. Oh. Another room. This is the statue of King Long, but it looks so much strange. This <laughs> pose is slightly different than that of King Long depicted in the mural. Maybe it means. It means stuff! Actually, that seems pretty close. Uh, 
Oh wait, not quite. Welcome back, Savage. It's going pretty good. Um, I mean, that's pretty close. What am I? Solving puzzles and uh, running through uh, the deep glacier. And that looks like a seal of a volcano. Is this really the ancient sea people's technology? Impressive. Heard some noise from afar. Must be the first contraption Nayamo told me about. How was work, Savage? Were the trucks nice to you? Ah. Uh... Yeah, that wasn't weird at all. Path up is now open. Let me return to the village and tell Tenzin about this. And I'm hungry. Of course you are. Going good. Only had three chem in, so I went back. Uh, to lab start processing samples for the last three hours or so. Oh, okay. Alright, glacial area. Made a new blurb that was somehow missing from the library. Oh yeah? It's a good blurb. I like it. Ice gun. Bone chilling gun can freeze anything. Nice. over here. Uh, 
managed to get 30 done and people prepping can't keep up. Probably gonna take off soon. Well, hopefully they don't try and call you back. Glacial Miso! Miso cold! That is a horrible joke. Oh, the current here is too strong to enter. I need the uh, iron boots. Talk to uh, Tenzin. We can try, but I'm already in OT, and with the weekend premium, they will go to someone they will have to pay less first. That's fair. I was just thinking there'd been uh, a couple of times where you're like, oh, I just got home and now I'm going back. So I was just hoping they didn't pull that shit this weekend. It is a holiday weekend too. Stuff. I do agree. I might be getting called in tomorrow, though. They already said they were going to be short. Oh no! Sorry, boss. I forgot to charge my phone last night. I don't know. I don't know how that would have happened. I always put it on the charger. The soundtrack of this area is amazing. <laughs> Sorry, I've been drinking, can't come in. It's only 5.30. You imply that me, or that would imply that I stopped drinking. 5.30, I'm still going.
contraption built by our ancestors that's difficult to operate <clears throat> and seems something caused the contraption to malfunction? I know it's not right to get you involved in our matters, but please do help us. The earthquakes are not your only problem. Humans are suffering from them too. I will find out the cause. Thank you. May the blessings of King Long be with you. <coughs> Nyama told me the story. The Divine Tree Control Room is malfunctioning. The cause is that it's causing earthquakes. Yes? Yes, I need to operate three switches to enter the control room. I've already activated one of them. Well done. I am ashamed of our people having to rely on you in this matter. Yeah, why not send them down to help? Please don't be. The earthquakes are a problem for us, too. I remember something. It was written on one of the ancient books. After some workers mutated into Gadons, the engineering uh, Dashes, due to engineer Dashes schemes, our ancestors created switches to access the control room to disperse the glacial and disperse to the glacial area. They created those switches to tighten the security. They have turned into obstacles now, denying access to the control room. It's still too cold, but the heat coming from the ground is melting the ice. Maybe the control room is overheating, causing the water temperature to rise. Stabilize the device and the water temperature will return to normal. I know it's rather impolite of me, but please hurry before our ancestral home is completely destroyed. There are two doors remaining. I will try to locate them. I did locate one. I don't know how to get through it. Oh, hey, stop. You haven't found it, such? Or haven't found it yet? Where did you search? Search the whole village, but no luck. Uh, what's going on, Rima? Oh, Dave. I think the beluga has suddenly gone missing. If he's not in the village, he could have gone to the other side of the glacial passage through the open door. He is a very curious kind, you know. You didn't hide him, did you? Why would I? Alright, I will let you know if I find him. Go find the beluga. <clears throat> Alright, well, they sent through the door. So let's see if he went through the door. Oh, hey, there, there's the barrel eyes. Those are the ones I need. Ah, I died. Mm -hmm. I hate the lightning harpoons. the beluga go
Oh, now I'm completely full. Alright, we need to go back. Deal with this next time. We have a cucumber party to hold. There's seeds available. <laughs> All the people in games are so concerned with the impending doom that they just can't seem to actually get off their butts and help. I know, right? It's like, oh, we're embarrassed. We're sending you to, uh solve our problems, but we're not going to do anything to help you. No, we're not that embarrassed. Please explain cucumber party so my imagination quits what it's doing. Um, so the tourism board for the uh, giant blue hole probably doesn't help. Uh, it is uh, spotlighting cucumbers. So any local businesses uh, with cucumber dishes can make a lot of money. It's it's a community wide thing. So we're going to throw a party tonight featuring cucumber dishes and charge an absorbent amount of money for cumber, people to come eat nasty, nasty cucumbers. Oh, God, the fireworks don't help. <laughs> Oh, that's horrible. Five hundred and fifty one meters. Does the uh the fireworks answer any of your questions there, <laughs> Savage? Sounds like a good plan. What being called the big blue hole didn't did in fact not help though. Well, it's it's the the large green cucumber in the big blue hole with some of the worst possible fireworks ever. Um, maybe this will help. Ah, uh, ba ba ba. There you go, cucumber party. That's just a plate of cucumbers and lettuce. That looks horrible. Have some, some, some flavor. Where is your flavor? Where is your texture? That would be a gremlin to include a dish that has sea cucumber in it. If I could find one, I would have. Oh, got the narwhal. I don't know what happened to it. It was alive last time I saw it. Jade pedestal. Okay. Oh, twenty eight. Twenty eight bucks. That ain't good. Ice gun, not quite yet. Okay.
All right. <clears throat> Let's go do the cucumber party thing. Can't uh, research any more dishes. So the menu. Cucumber dishes. I failed. Sea Dragon Onigiri. Okay. Going oh, those last 10 minutes, my break, and just leaving. That sounds fair. One, no, we're not putting it on the menu with just one. Ooh, haddock, okay. Twenty three at two oh nine, that's good. Narwhal meat. Well, the narwhal was alive the last time I saw it. Two more. I don't need sushi ASMR, but the scene was cool. Yeah, they're, uh, they're kind of special, aren't they? Ooh. 364, 313. We'll stop at 313 because I need food on the menu. Yeah, we'll update the ice fish. Sea unicorn. I didn't do it. All I did was uh, take it up to the surface so the scientists could look at it. It was alive the last time I saw it. Oh, uh, yeah, we'll upgrade that. Oh. 
Tiger shark. Tiger shark is, could be doable. They're fairly plentiful. 77, too low. Need to make some money. There we go. That should be enough food to cover the party. Cheapest one is 169 per portion. All right, this is gonna be crazy. Here we go. Um, okay. I didn't stop pouring it. Oop. Get off your phone while you're at work. Stupid uh, owner. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. I'm paying $169 on sushi, it better be blowfish. Oh, we blew past blowfish a long time ago. We just served uh, creatures that were frozen in ice that haven't been seen in centuries. We saw them swimming around and go, hey, that's weird, can I eat it? And then we did, and people paid for it. A lot. I mean, that is our best performing day by a mile. Come on, you can do it. Come on. There we go. Saturday, November 5th. Oh. All right, the fish mon this week, as detected by every radar, is a jellyfish of some kind with a wizard hat. Okay. Can't be a real jellyfish. Do you doubt the accuracy of our fish radar? Uh, Only slightly. It's a very difficult task detecting this jellyfish with our radar. The reason was <laughs> jellyfish teleports around at incredible speeds. Uh, I'm supposed to get a picture of it. Mm. It'll disappear as soon as you get near. You probably won't be able to catch it unless you have some sort of something like a sniper rifle. 
Well, good thing I pack a sniper rifle. About 100 meters underwater near the yellow shipwreck. That's what my information says. Now then, keep up the good work. Okay. Crops have all grown. Come hard of this. Oh boy, we grew cucumbers for the day after the cucumber party. Yay! I'm usually, uh, I mean, it doesn't always have to be snipers, but it's usually some kind of rifle. I'm just comfortable with rifles. All right, we got an egg for showing up. You also like a good DMR or assault rifle? Uh, DMRs are generally my favorite. Mid to long range. All right, so we're done with the cucumbers. What do we need? Let's do some wheat. Oh, only three. And some... Sure, cherry tomatoes. I don't know. Usually avoid burst guns. Uh, when I usually a headshot, it feels waste to use three bullets when only one is needed. Yeah, I, uh, I completely agree with that. Wheat, wheat, wheat. Tomato, tomato, tomato. If only it was that easy to farm. Alright, gotta feed the cat. My garden would look much better if it was that easy. I know, right? All right, it is upgrade time. I could upgrade uh, the carrying capacity. I don't know how the guy carries around 185 kilograms, but I guess he does. Salvage drone, level 2. 
That'd be tempting. Alright, so the dive knife is maxed out. I uh, just nixed off the uh, cargo, cargo box. The harpoon is maxed out and the dive suit is maxed out. So I can do salvage drone or air. Safety Otter has animals in a food establishment. I mean, animals can cook. Why not? Also, there are lots of restaurants that have pets in the uh, dining area. There are even restaurants that are completely pet friendly. You can bring your own. There are restaurants I've been to that have a menu for the animals. Thanks for the pets, Maddie. Just usually IRL, you keep the animals out of the kitchen. <laughs> oh, that's still funny. Hmm. So, Nachos doesn't yell for a ban if you play his blurps, but you play Mikey's and, and uh, it's banned Maddie. It is a great blurb. It's funny. It's funny, and it's adorable. Oh, it gets banned with any blurb? Okay. <laughs> ben Maddie from blurb. Uh, let's do... I guess let's do the salvage drone level two. Twelve thousand for level three. <laughs> the face of approval. Need to drive, you'll be lurking. All right, drive safe. So what I'm being told is turn up the sus for a little old shadow. Yeah, no, I'm going to keep my mouth shut.
No, one must not always share the thoughts. That's how one gets locked up. <laughs> the nice men in the white coats will be here soon. I'm not sus nachos. I just have a uh, season pass to the sus museum. You know, it's not quite as fun as sus factory, but I can get behind it. <laughs> not what I meant, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> Shrimp and turmeric. This, uh, that guy just seasoned himself. Oh, Thresher turned around to look away from the screen, and I got ambushed. There we go. In the sus factory, there are many rooms to accommodate those who are in need of it. Uh, which is called Naruto, er, Naruto, Naruto's, what? Wow, okay. Apparently I need more caffeine. Nacho's ponytail, that's a very different thing. <laughs> oh, urchin. these parrot fish are worth it. They're not worth anything. Not sure yet to say anything to defend himself, so it must be true. So saith the Maddie. <laughs> no. What I get when I poke fun at nachos. I need legs. Well, they just don't don't even care that I'm here.
All right, so there should be. Level three, yes, please. an easy catch. Alright, so there's supposed to be a teleporting jellyfish around here somewhere with a wizard's hat. going off. Where did it go? I guess. on the other side of the wall.
There it is. Oh, dang it. Where'd he go? Just completely look past the barracuda because there's a big old shark right there. Took a fight with a tiger shark with only one bullet. Black pepper. I like that Frank, uh, Frank, uh, harpoon. Works really well. Oxygen capsule. Yeah, that thing's pretty much out. We'll go ahead and swap it. Oh, not where I wanted to go. Okay, that's fine. Another oxygen capsule. Okay. And they're just throwing air at me down here. did. That's the first time I was able to get one of those without them exploding.
All right, you won't go to sleep. Fine. If you won't go to sleep, you go to hell. That was aggressive. Yay, leg bone, finally. Oh, hello. Let's try this. Oh, up and died. Oh, it's the underground lake. Hmm. All right. Sitting pretty good right now. Definitely need to up the uh, dive box. soon. Gun upgrade. Yes, please. Gold shark. Oh, just put it right to sleep. this one though not you not you ow This guy back to sleep. Oh, I just killed it. Okay. Should have did that the other way around then.
It didn't get all the way down to the bottom. Suppose that's okay. I'll head back down there. Uh, in the afternoon. Especially when you're uh, super over encumbered. Escape pod. All right. Ooh, black pepper is new. I didn't realize that. <laughs> What's the new fish bonjour collection? Mm. I think a jellyfish that looks like it's wearing a wizard hat actually exists. Mm. Send you your fee when the issue is out on Monday morning.
Oh, fine. It's actually got stars on it, too. Okay. getting there. do that and let's do that and we're gonna jump down to I guess the glacial area They came down to here. Fire it's cold. Human, your clothes look very warm. Why don't you go inside and take a look? You are weaker than you look. I'm surprised they're down here. Yay, finally home! Huzzah! Oh, there's the narwhal. Early for that. shark down here.
Oh, we got it just ate the trap. Big ass shark. the trap going off in the shark's stomach wasn't healthy? Probably not. To be fair. Should have been rather air supply up here somewhere. Ice tip, okay. Topaz, neat. I would have guessed gold. There's air. Furry block. Oh, oh, that guy. Forgot about that guy. Oh, sweet. Shark tooth. be a lot easier if I had nachos down here with me. Then all the sharks would focus on him. He could do a shark bait thing and I could just pick him off at my leisure. Poison four. Sure, we'll do poison four.
Ow. Okay, I need to get a rock. I need to decide what I want for dinner, and now nachos sound good. Haven't had any in months, uh, but pulled pork, pulled pork, chicken, or steak for my meat. Um, well, what kind of uh, seasoning on, like, your chicken? Are you doing, like, a marinated, like, fajita chicken, or... Um, because pulled pork is great, especially on nachos, but yeah, personally, I'd go for chicken or steak, or, or hear me out, both. Fajita chicken and a thinly sliced Southwest steak. Got to be a rock around here somewhere. talking about what savage should have for dinner uh he won he said uh nachos sounded good but he wasn't sure if he should do pulled pork fajita chicken or steak and i was thinking like a uh shredded fajita chicken uh with a um thinly sliced southwest steak Because why choose when you can just do both? Porque no los dos. All three. Oh, thanks for the pets, Chi. Guacamole person? Uh, yes. Only if it's good guacamole. Like the pre store bought stuff, not a big fan, but I usually uh, just make some myself. Aquamarine, nice. limes instead of lemon uh especially when you're dealing with meat absolutely uh because lime is a natural meat tenderizer um and it doesn't have the harsh uh acidity or uh, extra stringent flavor of the lemon so you can um you can uh use limes on meat as like a binder or something uh, without changing your flavor. Did I get back down here? I did. Hmm. So I heard something the other day. Well, this is over a month ago now. So the other day, 
uh, somebody had made some homemade guacamole and they left the avocado pits in the thing or in the Tupperware thing and I was confused by it I'm like why wouldn't you just take them out and uh, they were saying that if you leave the avocado pits in the container it doesn't uh, or the uh, avocado in, in the guac doesn't oxidize this quickly so it'll actually store longer I don't know if that's a hundred percent a thing but that's what they were saying and it's not like you can just accidentally eat an avocado pit Uh, very true. Oh, what did we find? Oh, the beluga. Why is it here? I don't know. Is this an Antarctic octopus? Uh, they're poisonous. Very smart octopus. Oh, this is how I get down that hole. Okay. Oh, no, never mind. Where are you going to go? Kind of looks pitiful up close. Oh, I get a pick on whether I uh, harvest the octopus that I've killed dozens of. I mean, captured dozens of. Uh, we're going to rescue it. An antidote, perhaps? Take it back to Beluga. Now I gotta go find that whale again. Shade fish. Octopus antidote. Yeah, octopi are very smart, but are they smart enough to carry an antidote to their own venom? That's a little weird. I mean, because video game, yes, but... Where the hell would an octopus have a bottle of antidote to its venom? I don't know. I mean, it's possible it's not its venom. Maybe it just found, maybe wrong place, wrong time. And how do you convince a whale to drink from a bottle? You want to try this? And instantly better.
Close it all. Well, I return to the village. And get there alone, right? How's it supposed to, uh... Use the mirror? I should explore some more. Yay! I found the thing. Just like in the movies, it's the the bullet being inside you that kills you, right? As soon as they pull it out, you're fine. The wound tracks they leave totally aren't the real problem. I know, right? seen several videos where like like Obi-Wan and, and guests are watching uh, and reacting to Star Wars films and whatnot and they have one where uh, Qui-Gon watches himself get stabbed <laughs> in the stomach by a lightsaber uh, it's like oh yeah well that does happen um, when they when they invent back to tanks oh like a day after this like the day later uh, and then a couple other people throughout different theories and movies get stabbed and they're like, oh, they're dead. No, they actually survive. Oh, that's bullshit. All right, I'm missing something. Kind of thought maybe the whale would show up and help me get through there. Would it cauterize itself? Yeah. I'm missing something. What am I missing? Yeah, yep. But Darth Maul survived because uh, he, he used uh, his hatred to have the dark side of the, the force um, sustain him. So Darth Maul survived because of magic, not because of any sort of medical know-how. said explore some more. He didn't go say go talk to somebody or
Yeah, I brought all that. here Check the open water top center, I guess. Even though I feel like I did that. Pretty sure that fruit or cracked floor is the way to get there. But other than like getting a pair of iron boots or some something, something like that, I don't really know what to do. I can't find a dislodged rock to drop on the floor. Like I would have thought. I don't know, maybe I come down with a, uh, with a mine or something. do often lead to good places. I mean, it's this right here, but it doesn't look like there's anything under it either. in video games, movies you might be getting murdered. Yeah, they're not always super great in real life either. There's that guy who got his arm caught in, this, in a crack in the side of a mountain. I think he had to cut his own arm off with a pocket knife. Alright, well, there was a shell around here somewhere. Down a rock, okay. I would say rarely. Uh, real life rarely lives up to games or movies.
Maybe there's something left in that first passage. Go see if they have anything to say about this. seeds that's fine mm -hmm. able to get some seaweed seeds oh cool I didn't even have to buy them some of their seeds you may purchase them from gumo and try cultivating them okay and hydrate okay how's it going today rusty Cannot. Manatee's baby just suddenly disappeared. I'm doing all right. Just trying to uh, make a little progress with uh, Dave the Diver here. suspicious place. I'll go check it out. Alright, so I found the whale. Now I gotta go find the manatee. The baby's run off. Oh, the huge manatee! Go see the beluga safely back again. Doesn't the beluga look more imposing than ever? Yeah, you're you're doing the the same thing you said before. Hmm. Me 
Maybe they would know how to get past number two. Same thing. All right. I don't think the predators are back. I hope not. the music down here slaps oh okay, we got a crying sound Said predators, and my brain went to the alien ones from the movies. I remembered you mean just the normal ocean ones. Oh yeah, no, I meant those too. I mean, I definitely wouldn't want to run into one of those down here. Is the, the cracked floor broken? Oh, there's the rock I've been looking for for an hour. Jackasses. Why can't I just go find it? Maybe I'll break it with something heavy. No shit. Let me guess, boss fight. Gotta be. Well, maybe not. It didn't say, you sense the presence of a dangerous creature.
Well, nothing down here so far. Not any fish at all. Maybe humanity looks scared. We need to calm it down. Oh no, it's cute. Hi, Zeno. Playing some uh, Dave the Diver. Oh, now I gotta escort it home. Okay. Narwhal. Of course, there's a narwhal. How uh, how's your how was your week, Zeno? Alright, well, now I have to murder a narwhal, so excuse me for a second. Oh no, I missed. That was bad. Damn thing damn near murdered my baby manity. What? It was the aggressor. Now I can't heal that. This is not going to be a good trip. Oh, because there's a shark. That is the first sea unicorn that wasn't alive when it left my sight. And yet you were doing the, the one doing the murders? Hi T, welcome back. Remember the... Yeah, we were singing that song earlier. Yeah, yep. No one's been breaking it. Go to Gumo. Chibi Safety Hound. Is this better? No, still not working. I 
hypersonic. Nice. I have some I don't know how they did it, but somehow they got my or they got me to go even smaller and they turned me into glitter. Also a Captain Planet reference. Mm-hmm. the beluga was stuck. Uh, I didn't... Was there one today, or... Got 109k left. Wow. No, don't wreck the otter. That's why we can't have nice things. <laughs> Hydrate? Okay. And party on. Big up. Talk to the farmer. A few days. I thought it was like yesterday. Um. No, it's probably a few days. You're probably right. Saturday might might work. I, I need to see um, when coal will be available. Meantime, I'm gonna have to love you and leave you with a lurk. Okay. Enjoy your lurk. Yeah, unfortunately, we just had to 
I mean, I wasn't expecting on us getting that done right then and there uh, that night, so that's why that played out the way it did. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, yeah, we'll get we'll get you taken care of, sorted out. Glad to see the moms nowadays. Also, we really have a good sense of smell, which is funny since I'm. I mean, yeah, we'll help you set up your cameras on on the thing, and push the button, and, and do the things like over here, or over here, or over here. Or maybe up here. Or hello. I see you. I see you. <laughs> Ooh, sea grapes. Nice. Aww. What a sweetie. I guess all we do now is we go hunt cookie cutter sharks. Because that's what the village needs. Those two are dicks. How many times are we going to save your village before you uh, chill out? Oh, come on. There we go. Stargazer, Fang Tooth, all right, I just need two cookie cutters here, Sharky, 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 Sharky. Not the right shark. Okay.
Oh, I thought there was ammo back here. Okay. Starfish. Grab some air. Need some cookie cutters. Me so okay. Sea glide. actually need those right now or miso lots of deep sea me deep sea miso tonight for don't do it don't do it you're gonna do it all right fine what did we learn shark it's a frilled shark i'm finding every shark except the one i want technically a shark. Ow. Premium cat food, because we got to feed the kitties.
Oh. Poison tip level one. I thought I was going to keep going. Shark. Shark. Um, hydrothermal. Oh, okay. Play shows down. Cookie cutter is down here. Yeah, no, we're not gonna just keep swimming around in circles. Hi, T. Seventy-two. I mean, yeah, but I also would like to get somewhere, too. I need to figure out how to get through that second door in the glacial area with the strong current. I feel like I need some iron boots or something. Along with the uh, Zora tunic. Or I need to find these two cookie cutter sharks and, uh, you know, 
take care of those. So they stop chasing or uh, hurting the children of the village. I was an hour underwater. 54 minutes. Longest dive on record. Nice. Oh, this guy again. It's stormy again. Don't miss this opportunity. Choo choo. Choo choo to you, dude. All right, go find this, uh, this vortex. Got a boss fight. Just gotta go find it. So, vortexes are fairly shallow and very, very loud. Actually, how do I drop that? Because my dive knife is better now. Tip reef shark at night. Discard. Lightning harpoon, okay. Oh, I hear the vortex. And that's a shark. Some more text that didn't take long to find at all. Such a dangerous creature's presence. Let's do this. It's a good thing Xeno went to bed, he probably wouldn't approve. What are we up against? Can't be worse than Klaus. Ended up in a strange place again. 
place looks uninhabited. Does it though? Rifle level three. Hello. Is that a boxing lobster? Mantis shrimp. It is a boxing mantis shrimp. A giant crawfish wearing boxing gloves. All right. Must be a mantis shrimp. Size is unreal. Guess he could crush me with one hit. Be nice if I could find something tough to block that thing's punches. Oh, you mean like this thing? Well, that didn't work. Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, uppercut. Oh, that hurt. Bit me with its butt. Also, there's no air back here. Oh, six. Uh oh, uh oh. Five, four. I don't have an air tank on me. All right, I'm supposed to do something with this. Okay. Come on, drop those. Ow. Oh, it dropped more ammo. Okay. shrimp boil the water when the, they punch so fast? I guess. 
Aw, oh, thanks for the pets. Hey, yeah, that was close. Must be worth something worth picking up. a thing. I'm a stone cold murder otter. Beat the boss. I guess we go harvesting a few things and call it a night. Go, go work in the restaurant. Oh, sweet. You can only catch more eels at night. And they're not super plentiful. Our oxygen. The night dives are uh, super pretty, but they are very traditionally super dangerous. Everything is just, well, armed with teeth. I don't think there's any non-aggressive uh, creatures out. Yep. 
Is this medium depth? Yeah, medium depth. Oh, I only have one bullet. Okay. Leg? No, this foot. tonight. Usually a, a tiger or something lurking around. shark. Ow. So during the day, this guy would be done already. There we go. Fish. Well, that's a level one lightning, so this is poison level two. Uh oh, trank level two. No damage, okay. surprised I'm there's not more activity out here tonight oh hey there we go
you'd think an otter who's used to fighting demons would have better aim. Ow. Uh, sure. I'm gonna regret using that on that guy. Kind of a small fry. Oh, wow. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. There we go. Oh, there's a tiger and friends. I just let the tiger shark get between me and the ammo. Both of my uh, drone calls. You guys are annoying. I mean, you're probably saying the same thing about me. Which would be fair. Oh, is that myself? Come on. 
I see you. Still got hit. There we go. Oh, rank eight. Nice. I have so many skulls. Oh, I definitely need, uh, need, uh, air now. Sure, why not? Level three, wow. should put me at wait oh no oh it doesn't i lied i'm sorry chad i lied to you oh another uh another more ale now we're getting there That's going to be a good dive. Very successful dive. Come on. Sweet. A mantis shrimp boss card. I haven't seen it even at the gym. I mean, at the gym I work out at. You transfer this card using share. Okay, I got it. Welcome back, cruel. Ooh, thunderstorm. I don't know what that is, but I got it. All right. 
It is time to go to work. Rice, get their weeds. Chat, if anybody is like a fan of games like, say, Stardew Valley, I highly recommend this one. It is crazy. It does have a have a habit of going from zero to 60 and back in the blink of an eye. Um, but most of it is fairly chill. Bunch of little bits and bobs you got to do. Oh, and now we get to be a TV ship again. Hello, everyone. This is Yui from the NDC station. Ladies and gentlemen, as you know, today is the day of the final class in Challenge the Chef. Boncho, are you ready? How about you, Alex? Ready. My fingers are uncontrollably wiggling. That sounds... Un... Well, that sounds bad. Excellent. Let, let's begin challenge the chef. Oh, he's the tiger too. Oh, I give him his own thing. Can't give him a phoenix or something? I mean... Alright, cut the cow. S... D... Okay. Oh, geez, Chef, you're wasting food. Batter the fish and starch. Oh, they're a little octopus. good okay one is fish and chips oh that momo's in there
Ooh, 91 versus 96. Okay. What? Alex's fish and chip lost? What an upset! My fries are the best in the world. Yes, your fish and chips indeed tasted excellent. Incredible, actually. Well, what's the theme of the contest? The theme? It's fried dishes. Not quite right. The theme of this contest was fried the sea. Masterfully fried cod is good on its own, but alone it does not represent the sea. However, Boncha's dish was... What kind of soy sauce did you use? I did chop green laver and added it to an, the normal soy sauce. As I expected, I liked your shark and squid combination, but the highlight was the soy sauce recipe. The soy sauce enriched with flavor of the sea was better. Flavor of the sea better represented the taste of the sea. What an impressive flavor. Your dish gave me a feeling of exploring the sea, from the coastal waters to the deep sea. It was a fabulous adventure. The texture of your fried dish was good as well, but the game changer was your soy sauce. Alas, my perfect fries were not enough to satisfy the judge. It was a close match. Let's hear what Boncho has to say. You need to be careful when making the soy sauce. That's... Thank you, Buncho! Champion prefers action over words, and we love it. And it's time to wrap up today. Today's episode of Challenge The Shop. Today, Buncho won the contest. This is... Wait a moment. And please buy today's contest, and would like to give him a piece of advice. I see your menu is expanding, but the drinks you offer stay the same, yes? Because I am a chef, not a barkeep. Oh, okay. Um... Weird. Delete. Is that better, Savage? Cool. Alright, um, because I am a chef, not a barkeep. You said the same thing before. Dining is a co comprehensive experience. What do you pair... What do you pair with your pasta? A glass of wine, a glass of cola, or just a glass of water? It will significantly change the dining experience. Your place cannot satisfy the various tastes of the customers with a limited selection of drinks. My gift to you, it's a cocktail dispenser. Oh, nice. Hmm, cocktails? They don't go well with sushi, though. I disagree. I 110% disagree with that statement. Oh, please, not every cocktail is sweet. You can make interesting cocktails using sake as a base. Well, of course, you're not in charge of drinks. That hungry looking guy. Hey, yes, you. I will leave this cocktail dispenser here. Find out how best to use it. Nice. Bunch of sushi will offer more menu items soon. And we can't wait to see what's added to its menu. See you next time. This was Reporter Yui. Oh, she talks a lot. Not as much as the hiring lady, though. Cocktails! This dispenser's designed to serve three different cocktails at the same time. I'm not familiar with cocktails, but come to think of it. This is like a drink version of... I'm not even going to try. Nope. You can't make me. Yeah, that makes sense. It's our job to serve the drinks to customers want. Why don't we make more money by adding cocktails to the menu? 
because it costs more too. From now on, customers will begin to order cocktails. Serve cocktails as requested, as requested in the right order. Okay, cool. Oh, wow. That's a lot of... Alright, well, we can do... Mantis shrimp with soy paste. Research 30 new dishes. Nice. Hmm. Mackerel scramble. Does that actually sound good to anybody? Lobfish spring roll. Fried tomato and snail fish. Tomato egg soup. Huh. All right, ba ba ba. Oh, we can serve what they just made. Okay, we'll do that. Makes five portions. Gotcha. Make it better, make it better. Here we go. Greenland shark, huh? I have 15 of those. Spider crab and cucumber? Huh. Sea dragon, sea toad and cucumber. There we go. All right. <clears throat> Make some money. If only it was as easy to make money in real life as it is in video games.
Alright, how do we do this? Good? Alright, I'll take good. Get out of here. Oh, I'm so close. Nowhere near as good today. That's fine. All right, I think uh, I think the game is, lack of a better word, tired. Uh, we've been playing it for nine hours. It's been a fantastic Friday. I really think uh, I think now might be a good time to call it though. Have to enter the cave without flowing current. Turn on second control room. Is there any way to enter the cave? Current may be weaker today. I should go check. Oh, new greeting sound? Nope, oh, it's from the new game I am playing these days. What game are you playing? It's Gaio. Game raising digital fish. You feed them and keep them happy and they grow and mutate. That sounds somewhat familiar. I've been feeding Gaio as I get up uh, in the morning. Come to think of it, I completely forgot to do it today. Wait a sec. All right, now I'll give it a snack. All right, look, Gaio is satisfied. Why don't you try it yourself? I shared the app with you uh, using share with friend. Should, you'll be able to experience something fun besides just catching fish. Uh, no. Well, maybe later. Oh, it's a freaking Tamagotchi. It is. It is exactly a Tamagotchi. Oh, the only way to win that game is to not play. Do I check it? All right, what's the next event? Curry! Woo! Curry party! Hello, everyone. Uh, this is Spice Lab. We research the perfect combination of various spices and ingredients. We've heard that the waters of Blue Hole are like a world fair that exhibits all kinds of marine species. What kind of... All at all, surprise, uh, shall we find when various fish species meet? Um, we will embark on this culinary journey in three days. Our cho chosen ingredient is curry. Curry is well known for, his, for its anti-cancer and anti-dementia properties. Uh, meet this new taste, the blue hole at the party. The spice lab, okay. We can do curry. All right, so I'm not gonna do anything else because I went and double did it. You never had a Tamagotchi? Um, lucky? I don't know, even as a kid I found them annoying, but I wasn't smart enough to say no. <laughs> All right, so I think that's where we're gonna end it. Uh, the game definitely wants a rest. Uh, it's been over nine hours. Um, so yeah. You have a great night as well, Savage. Let me get over to the BRB screen here. Uh, get out of the way so we can say thank you to all the wonderful beans um, that showed up. Everybody, I appreciate you guys being here. Um, it really does mean the world to me. Um, 
Uh, ba, ba, ba. So tomorrow, I don't know what's going on. Um, we'll do something. Maybe something completely different. Maybe the same old, same old. I don't know, but we'll figure something out. Um, maybe play more Baldur's Gate? Uh, it's a good question. So uh, we'll be back here tomorrow at noon Eastern. Uh, Sunday we're off, and then we're back Monday noon uh, Eastern as well. Uh, we'll be back, um, well, for the full week. So Monday, I think we're going to finish Manhunter and move on to a different different game. Tuesday, we'll be doing more Ori and the Will of the Wisps. Um, and then, uh, ba ba ba. Wednesday, we've game with Wookie. Thursday is obviously through Hell Thursdays, and Friday we'll we'll try and uh, see if we can't can't uh, get further in Dave the Diver. This game has surprised me with how long it is. I thought it was a short little fun game thing. Um, it's definitely a lot of fun, but it ain't short. So, yeah. All right, so it is September. We will be doing a subathon later in the month. Um, I don't know if it'll be a capped one, an uncapped one, a reverse one. Um, I got some game keys we can try and um, raffle off. I uh, got some different games. Some people have talked about doing some spoopy streams, so maybe we'll see about uh, getting some, you know, more. I know we do some weird, like, dark stuff on the channel, but maybe we'll try and go for something a little more scary. Um, or maybe something the complete op opposite. I'd like to get some community games going. Uh, got a lot of stuff to figure out. So I'm going to go work on that. I'm going to send you over to uh, Corgi Cam, a uh, good friend, good friend of the, um, well, a good friend of mine, good friend of Cole's. Um, they are starting their subathon today. Uh, last time they went 42 days so go send them some love um at least give them a hug they'll probably need it here sh sooner than later uh but anyway i'll send you over there i thank uh, thanks again for being here uh so until next time take care of each other uh be kind to each other and stay awesome strays see ya